Hey, what's up, y'all? Welcome to the J. Anthony YouTube channel. J. Anthony checking in with you, man. Today, I got this super clean 2000 Chevrolet single cab short bed LS 4.8 V8 power windows, power options, the whole nine. Man, look at this truck for real, for real. So I really went over this whole truck with a sand buff polished wax, the whole nine. But my one detail that I told my buff guy to do was to keep this pinstripe. Do not remove the pinstripe. And whenever I get a truck that has an original pinstripe like this, my number one goal is to preserve this pinstripe. That says a lot about a 24-year-old 24 vehicle. And I also tell them to leave the LS badges. Even if it got cracking like this one, dude, leave it. It's original, man. But let's check out this truck, man. I got brand new tires. You know what I'm saying? And even, you, you, you know one impressive thing about this truck that you got to note? Even the tailgate on the truck is nice, man. Now, I got this truck from the original owner. A guy posted up on Facebook kind of questioning what it was worth. His brother passed over. Him and his brother were working on the truck as a project. So uh, me and him came to an offer. He was lived right down the street. It was kind of a coincidence, man. He was literally right here down the street. Posted the truck on Facebook, and I got and I got it first deals. You know what I'm saying? So I don't know. I guess kind of looked up. Maybe he knew who I was, and he knew I was right here. He posted up. He knew I was gonna get it. Who knows, man? But really, look at this truck, like for real. Like, let's get the camera off of me. Let's get the camera on this truck, man. Like, now I really want. I'm. All right, all right, all right. I, I'm gonna. I'm, I'm gonna stop playing. I'm gonna stop playing. Come check out the guts. Come check. Check out them guts. Check out the guts on this truck. 150,000 original miles. We got a full sound system in the truck. A whole nine. I think it's either 210s, 212s. I ain't really looking into it, but it's Alpine. Sounds amazing. It sounds great. Let me let y'all hear this motor. It's a 4.8. It's not a 5.3. It's a 4.8. It don't matter. Same dang block. Just bigger. Look at this. All right, so if you know your stuff, it's a 2000. So it got that square intake top instead of the round intake top, which makes it an early 2000. And it changed it to late 2000. They go to the round, the round intake top. Uh-oh, I hear that sound system trying to beat a little bit. I can't get no copyright on this video, so I, I, can't, I, can't, I, can't, I can't play the music. I can't let no copyright. Look at that, man. And they're jamming. <laughs> and they're jamming. 150,000 original miles. So truck has two owners, I believe. But it's really a one owner truck because this is the story. So the guy I bought it from, it was originally his dad's truck. So his dad passed away. Then it became his truck and his brother's truck. So really kind of a one owner, but two owners on the Carfax, you know what I'm saying? But we got a super sharp truck right here. I am thinking about posting this truck at 9950. And here's the thing about this truck. I had one. I'm, I'm gonna drop the clip. I'm gonna drop the clip of the truck. I, I think I posted a YouTube video on there. If I did, I'll drop it right here. For me to find this one, it was pretty cool. I feel like I overpaid for it, but it's all good. Uh, I will be asking 9950 for this truck. It has 208,000 miles. Man, I would like to be a little lower on this truck at like 89, but I've got a lot of money in it, believe it or not, guys. And another thing, but that truck had 200,000 miles and I got $10,000 for that truck. And a dude came all the way from Oklahoma to get that truck. So I'm thinking with this truck having 150,000 miles, one note and two, this truck is way cleaner than that truck with 200,000 miles. Like this truck is actually nice. You know what I'm saying? So I'm thinking, dang, well, let me put the truck at the same price. You know, I got the truck for a good deal. I'm not even gonna try to gouge the market. I'm gonna put this truck at a great price because this truck is gonna give me an idea of how the market is doing on single cabs because I got another single cab truck. I got it up for 20,000. It's got 40,000 miles and it's not moving. So this truck on the lower tier end, 150,000, put it at 10 grand, and let me see, let me see what's going on in the single cab market because 
My take on the single cap market is it's kind of slower for me from what I've seen. I don't really prefer the single cap market. I prefer crew cab or extended cab, four wheel drive. That's just my preference. So this is kind of going to give me some insight on how the single cap market is doing because I'm pretty much posting the truck for a steal to, to, so it can just go quick. I want a quick sale on this truck. I'm not trying to sit around on this truck like I'm doing with this other truck. This one got 40,000 miles right here. And it's a cat eye. 42,000 original miles. I still got this truck. Y'all that follow the channel, y'all keep y'all stay subscribed to the channel. Y'all know this truck. I bought it back in December and I still got it, man. I went to California and got it. Truck's still here, you know what I'm saying? But this truck, I'm not trying to be sitting around on this truck for three, two, three months. You know what I'm saying? This truck should be gone, man. In and out. Brand new tires, original look. And you know what we call this truck? This a sleeper truck. Well, why is this a sleeper truck, Jay Anthony? What makes this a sleeper truck? Well, this truck right here, you don't know who in it. You don't know if I'm in it. You don't know if my papa in it. You don't know if my little brother in it. You don't know if my sister in it. You don't know who in it. Cause ain't no, ain't no style to the truck. It's a, it's a plain Jane old truck. Look, you got the chrome, you got the chrome things right here. You know what I'm saying? Original wheels. That automatically puts you in the mind of somebody older, right? Okay, but then you come inside and you hear that joker beating. Boom, 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 boom. Let me show you. You see that thing beating a little bit, you know what I'm saying? Okay, you think it's somebody younger now, and you see the big old screen on the dash, you know what I'm saying? You think it's somebody younger, you think it's a young guy. Then you got the, yeah, you think it's somebody, then you also got HIDs right here. You got HIDs in the front. That's that's more of a younger thing. So you don't know who in the truck. You tint it. I got 20% tint all the way around in the truck. So you don't know who in it. That's why we call this truck Sleeper. That's this name, Mr. Sleeper right here, man. But hey, I'm putting the truck at 9950. I'm posting the truck for sale tonight. So if you're reaching out, you're interested, get in where you fit in, give me a shout. You got my info, Instagram, Facebook, wherever, man. Y'all know how to reach me. And if you are an out-of-state buyer, I do not charge tax or extra fees to out-of-state buyers. I only charge tax and fees to in-state Texas buyers because I have to. Uncle Sam wants his money. I'm, I'm not, I'm not, that's, that's not, that's not between me and you, that's between you and Uncle Sam, and I got to deal with Uncle Sam, you know, so, hey man, but I really appreciate the support that you have shown to this channel, we are at 2,000, a little bit over 2,000, the channel is actually growing pretty quick, we didn't got like 60 subscribers just in the past day and a half, so, whoever knew out there, hey man, we love GMT 800 trucks right here, baby, we love them, man, we love them, man, we got, I got this one coming up, I got this one coming up, this is my work truck right here. I got this one I've been had. I got this one, the single cab right here. I got this, I got that, I got that. I got an S10 over here. Then we got the garage over here, man. Man, we be working over here, man. We, we GMT 800 enthusiasts around here, dog. And I was trying to get this blue Super Sport that's in Oklahoma right now, but dude say he got a buyer. Look, I got, I got Super Sports in here, man. I love GMT 800s, man. So, hey, you new to the channel, I'm in Dallas, Texas. Feel free to reach out, man. And jump in them comments, too. I always reply to the comments. But on the meantime, man, I appreciate you guys for tuning in to the channel. Please like and subscribe. Jay Anthony, out.